I'm Kevin O'Flaherty. I hope you enjoyed this Learn About Law video and podcast presented by O'Flaherty Law. If you need some help, please feel free to give us a call at 630-324-6666. That's 630-324-6666. We offer free consultations in many areas of law, and we have several locations for your convenience. Thank you so much for watching and listening. Hi, this is Andrew with O'Flaherty Law. In this video, we'll discuss defending a deportation and removal order. A person may find herself in removal proceedings because she has been declared deportable or inadmissible according to the federal government. While deportation and inadmissibility cases are lumped into the same removal proceedings process, um, the defense against one versus the other can be very different. This is why deportation and removal law can become very complex and frustrating. Having a qualified attorney on your side can greatly increase your chances of avoiding deportation and removal. So in general, deportation deals with non-citizens who were legally admitted to the United States, while inadmissibility exists to remove non-citizens who are seeking permanent resident status in the U.S., trying to get into the U.S., or those who entered the U.S. but were somehow not admitted. For example, a non-citizen may have a minor criminal charge that would flag her as inadmissible, but it would not trigger any ground for deportation. Some common reasons for deportation are going to include things like the immigrant is in violation of non-immigrant status or violated condition of entry into the U.S., or helped another alien enter the U.S. illegally, or convicted a criminal offense that triggers deportation or inadmissibility, or engage, uh, engages or has engaged in any activity or group that endangers others or creates a national security risk. Another would be committed marriage fraud, marriage fraud in order to gain access to the U.S. or fa uh, falsified documents in order to get into the U.S. Filed to terminate a conditional permanent resident status is going to be another one as well. The different defenses against deportation and inadmissibility are numerous. Some common ones include um, family-based adjustment of status, you can also renew your Form I-751 Removal Conditional Release. You can try to work with a lawyer and getting a criminal waiver release or non-criminal waiver release, depending on what the crime was. Um, there's also the Violence Against Women Act, uh, the cancellation of removal for U visas for victims of crimes who are helpful in the investigation of a crime. Um, then there's asylum, withholding of removal and relief under the Convention Against Torture Act as well. Lastly, there is voluntary departure in lieu of having an official order of removal from the court. This option can keep your immigration record clean from an order removal. Having a prior order for removal can make getting back into the U.S. difficult. Um, there are a number of other deportation and inadmissibility defenses available, and finding one that applies to your situation is key in avoiding a removal order. A qualified immigration attorney will determine the best option for your situation and can guide you through the defense process. If you have any questions about the deportation and removal process, or if you or a loved one has been issued a deportation notice, don't hesitate to give us a call at 630-324-6666. As always, thanks for tuning in. Hi, Kevin O'Flaherty again from O'Flaherty Law. Hope you enjoyed our presentation of Learn About Law. If you need some help, please feel free to give us a call at 630-324-6666. That's 630-324-6666. We offer free consultations in many areas of law, and we have several geographic locations for your convenience. If you found this helpful, we'd love it if you'd subscribe to us on YouTube, SoundCloud, Apple Podcasts, or wherever you listen to your podcasts or watch your videos. Thank you so much for watching and listening. Thanks so much for watching our video. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below. Click the subscribe button for new videos every week and download and review us on iTunes. Visit learn-about-law.com for other legal-related articles and videos. Visit our business podcast and video blog, seizeyourbusiness.com. And visit Making Real Estate Fun for real estate videos and podcasts. Call us at 630-324-6666 for a free consultation.